Senator Lincoln Chafee is in the war zone tonight with a small group of governors. The Department of Defense sponsored the trip to Kuwait and Afghanistan, and the governor told us via satellite he heard firsthand from local soldiers how close they are to the Taliban every day. I would assume supporter Walt Buto interviewed the governor, and he joins us now with more on what he had to say, new at 5. Governor Chafee traveled through a sandstorm to visit one group of local soldiers in Kuwait and then went to Afghanistan where he came very close to the combat zone. Rhode Island soldiers in a forward operating base outside Kabul showed the governor a vehicle that was destroyed by an IED. Have you seen and told him how complex and fragile security and peace are? That's, that's really the, the frustration as they uh, voiced with us, just who are setting these IEDs? Where are the Taliban? How do they mix in the local population, which are right outside the walls? Uh, yeah, they're right there, surrounding where all these Rhode Islanders are. Before Kabul, the governor traveled two hours through a desert in Kuwait to meet with Rhode Island soldiers who are moving equipment out of Iraq. Conversations there move from the dangers they face every day to simple questions about the Rhode Island weather they miss. And, uh, it's hot, it's dusty, a sandstorm came through, uh, and they're going to be away from their families for all summer. I won't be back till the fall. So it's just a tremendous, tr tremendous sacrifice. And Governor Chafee is one of three U.S. governors who are with the Department of Defense in Afghanistan through the end of the week. Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.